Kimberly is back now with some ideas to help your overnight guests feel even more at home. So yeah. this is once again, if you really like them and yes. you want them to stick around, <laughs> you're going to make it so comfortable for them that they're going to love it. Yeah. So first tip though, by the way, once you finish adding all these things, sleep in the guest room and just see what it feels like. That's a, right That's away true. do that. Okay? It might be cold. It might be too hot. You don't know until you try it. That's right. And the furniture that we showed at the top of the show all have these great back pillows. Mm. So one thing you can do is you can buy back pillows, which really help accommodate reading in bed and are super comfortable and lovely. And don't forget to pillows. Everyone has a different preference when it comes to a sleeping pillow. Yeah. So I actually keep a few different extra beautiful, nice, clean, new sleeping pillows. So if you come to my house, you're not worried what you're sleeping on. Uh, because nice. people, for some people, like that's the difference between sleeping and not sleeping at all. So yeah. a soft down, a heavy, you know, foam, whatever. My daughter likes that one that's like hard as a rock and foam really? that molds to your head. Oh. I can't lift it. I don't understand yeah, it. Yeah, me neither. Um, but anyway, um, a, a throw, an extra throw, because everybody sleeps at a different temperature. I'm always cold. So just because you're hot, mm -hmm. assume that maybe somebody could be different. Yeah. These are really fun. All, all of this fun stuff came, by the way, most of it from Bed Bath & Beyond. And these are socks that have moisturizer in them. Oh. Yes. Isn't that nice? And you're not commenting on your, your aunt's scaly feet. <laughs> no. It's just something to make her comfortable. It's something nice to do. <laughs> <laughs> a sleeping mask is a really good thing to have in the room, especially yes. if you don't have blackout draperies, because again, sometimes people just can't sleep at all. Yes. Fresh, clean towels for the holidays. We've got the red here again from Bed Bath & Beyond. I think it's always nice to allow your guests to be able to make their own coffee and get their own water. Oh, so anything yes. you can do to accommodate that, a little coffee maker is lovely. Yeah. If there's room and there's a budget, a little mini fridge is wonderful for oh, water, wow. etc. Are you kidding? They're never going to leave. Exactly. <laughs> That's a good idea. But you know what? At the very least, you can do the carafe of water. You just bring a pitcher. Totally. Um, and a couple of cups. And even that's nice. Because I know exactly. I'm like this and my mom's like this. We must sleep with a, a glass of water beside our bed. You never know if you're going to get up, have a coughing fit, or you're just dry. It's a nice thing to it's, do for your It's guests. a really nice thing to do. Mm -hmm. And then a tray, maybe. You know, maybe they want to sit up and watch late night television. Yeah. Uh, or, or stay in bed and watch uh, City Line all morning. That's, That's great. Right. You want to make that easy for them to do. So a little tray that goes over them in bed. Now nice. for some luxury additions. Okay. Aroma Time by Sage is a great um, diffuser. It smells so amazing. Isn't it delicious? So yes. what's cool about it is when you open up the lid, there's two different reservoirs now. One is East. Uh -huh. And one is west. Okay. East being the sun comes up in the morning. So you might want to put a, a scent in there that's invigorating. Mm -hmm. So I've got in there right now liquid sunshine, which smells oh. really good. It smells amazing. I just like the idea of it. And then west, of course, the sun goes down. It's You know, you can put in something that's for tranquility. Like lavender. Or something to boost your immune, immune system. Yes. Uh, stress relief. So beautiful scents. It also is a clock. So you just have to be able to fill that with water. Again, a big crack is a wonderful thing to have. Nice. A lighted mirror. If you're over 40, you want <laughs> right? you want to know if there's a chin hair happening yeah. right now. You want to be the one to find it, not right. anyone else. Yeah, I have something on your face. Oh, right, like, dear. Oh, no. <laughs> Awkward, yeah. It's attached. So a terrific lighted mirror is a great choice. Mm -hmm. uh, the lamp from Ikea, by the way, has a charging station for your phone. Yeah. So this stays plugged in. You say, oh, they like that. Well, it's just. Just, it's such a simple thing, but man, does this make a difference. A lot of people have right. their phones right beside their bed. This is yep. a great double duty piece. And you do feel sort of annoying when you're always asking the host, can I have this, can uh, I have that? Yeah. So um, the uh, humidifier, cold mm. and hot air humidifier, a lovely addition as well. Sleek. And I always like to provide some reading material. So this year, one of my friends gave me the interior designer um, paper doll. Oh, oh, that is adorable. Super cute. So, and then and inside, it's like little Elle says, wallpaper on the chimney breast will give it some interest. <laughs> so, and then there's the little wallpaper that you can stick on the chimney breast, right? Uh, that is so cool. So, I like the idea that you've thought of this. I actually have some reading material that I found. Just in the newspaper, I'm looking at the crossword puzzle, and I see 45 down. Let's see what it says. City Line guest expert Kimberly blank Selden. Selden. Here is the crossword puzzle. deal around here. So in 2018, I only will answer to 45 down. <laughs> 
I mean, new no moniker. No one's allowed to look me straight in the eyes. That's right. Anymore. That's Please what's happened follow that. that. Yeah, my kids were super impressed, which is great. I love the look of this. What is this, uh, Kimberly? Okay, it's a beautiful speaker, different patterns that can cover it, very discreet. And you can do this. Alexa, who is the host of the TV show City Line? Here's something I found on Wikipedia. City Line is a talk show and lifestyle television program hosted by Tracy Moore and produced by City Talk. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't she fabulous? She's amazing. So cool. Okay, this is actually called the Fabric Chorus. Uh, it retails for about $100. So what's good about this is you can use it for cooking, you can use it if you need help in the kitchen, if you want to know what movies are playing. Yes.